Hey, what's up everybody? This is my dinner dive the other day. I took some of the things you said in the comments and I added it into this dive. I actually took my floater out. This is my first drop. I'm going to do something that if you watch uh, Ryan Myers says not to do. I'm going to drop on top of a boulder. So I perch myself on this boulder looking out into the crevice. Just trying to chill, just trying to relax. I'm really not trying to shoot anything. If something swims by, great. I just want to get my body feeling comfortable. You know, loosen up the tightness in my chest, work on my downtime. So this should be maybe a little over a minute. I'm just cruising. You can see these three Moano swim by. Kind of small, It'd be fun to uh, hook up on a light tackle. There's some Nenui and King Kole's Umomole. But I saw something out of the corner of my right eye. So I kind of bailed. And lo, lo, lo and behold, school little bait fish with a little barracuda swam by. I rarely see barracuda out here. So I thought, oh, that's pretty cool. I'll just kind of cruise with him. So you can see it swimming off in the distance, kind of pretty much in the center of the picture. So I grunt a little, just try not to move, and he turns around, and he comes back. You can see him there. So smooth, so effortless. I love these guys. He's kind of cruising. I'm breathing up. I'm debating as to whether to try to see if I can get him, but I'll make a drop. So I make the drop, trying to go behind that boulder so I can look out over it. And I look up and he's not there. I look to my left and there he goes with the bait fish swimming off into the blue. I just watched them go by and just took in the beauty of the moment. It was um, pretty cool. So there, there's my floater. I wasn't lying. So here's my next drop. Breathed up a little bit. Scanning the grounds, looking for a place to land. And I'm kind of thinking I'm going to drop between those two rocks. So I make the drop. I'm working on trying to be as relaxed as possible, heading to the bottom. Land, get my handhold. And I'm right where I want to be, right between the cracks. And there's Mr. King Cole swimming over between the rocks. I figure I better take something. I line up and take the shot. It was a real good shot. Went right through, uh, right where I wanted to hit it uh, so I don't damage the meat. Knocked off a little sea urchin there. And I have my first fish for the kui. So now I went out on this dive, like I said, trying to do something different. So I wanted to target a nai nai because I wanted to cook this up um, a special way. I wanted to experiment with that. So that's kind of what my next drop is going to be. I was hoping to get that one, a nai nai first, but uh, I didn't really see any. So I dispatched the King Kole, swam out, breathed up, and here's my third drop of the day. So I head down and I'm kind of want to drop behind this boulder. So you can see I'm hitting that little flat patch. Made my drop just where I wanted to. Look up over the boulder. Mm -hmm. And 
and there's the Nainai in the distance. It's a little too far away, so I start crawling over the rocks very slowly, just with using my um, left hand, dipping my head so it, I'm not looking at it. Still crawling, looking up, take the shot, stoned it. I don't like this particular shot that I took uh, coming in from the back, uh, but it was pretty clean. I stoned it. It didn't damage the meat, but it's hard as heck getting the spear out because it went right through the head. So I did shoot something else. I did take my floater out, and I do have something special for you at the end. It's a super short clip. Uh, I took my fish out on the land. I threw it in a tide pool, and this happened. The eel came and tried to get it. Aloha.